What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the VO2 Max channel. Uh, when last we left off, we're, oh, even before I say that, uh, let's just say we are joining back up with Hammer Bro. Um, we went over his gear last time. We got Twin Spirits, which is awesome. We got the lore. We got Stealth, which can be upgraded. Got a little bit of Replenish Life. Eh, nothing great. Faster Run Walk. Eh, nothing great little bit of MF that's that's all our MF so 35% I think uh, nope 41% I put my foot right in my mouth 41% MF nothing crazy but we got lots to plus skills our lore gives us plus skills we have total five plus skills so that brings us to 25 for concentration 25 for blessed hammer uh, six for smite charge and holy shield currently six to holy bolt six to might uh six to holy fire 24 to blessed aim 25 to concentration i think i said that already six to defiance excuse me 13 to vigor six to prayer and six to cleansing um i'm going to pick up a fanaticism at some point and that'll give us a six point as well and then blessed aim we're on our last point of blessed aim before we switch over to vigor and then we'll be laughing uh we're trying to work on our dexterity here a little bit we do this and we've got a 41 percent block so that's not too too bad um but yeah so last time i left off i i think we had just started act five i told you i would do some farming off screen which i did did a few pindle skin runs and eldritch runs uh, a couple more Andy runs, a couple of Mephisto runs, just kind of did did some stuff. Didn't really get anything terribly crazy. Filled out my uh, <laughs> filled out my stash again because I got a few uh, few uniques in there. So I gotta go in and get more mules and make make things disappear. Um, and that's actually what I I might do is just go in and pull everything out of that one collected stash. And just put all my uniques together, put all my whatever's together, just go, call it. I'm going to make new characters now that I'm thinking about it. I'm going to make new characters called, you know, uniques, set items, and just put them all in the, the personal inventories. And then that should be that should be easy enough to do. Just unique one, unique two, you know, set one, set two, whatever. However many characters I got to make. But anyways, so I gone, I've gone through, I've cleaned up i can't show you the waypoints because i don't have them opened up but i've cleaned up a few more waypoints and we have one in this previous spot and now that i'm thinking about it we should definitely set a safety tp um and we are now at the nightmare ancients on players eight so let's just see how this goes let's see if we can pull one of these guys over here just by himself nope come on the idea here is to just kind of drag one and just hope that one comes over. One is much easier to deal with than three. Oh god. <laughs> he says with three. But we'll see how it goes. See how it goes. I don't even know what the health is right now. Just trying to keep Emilio alive. Oh, we got one. There's one down. There's two down. Okay. Okay. We're doing all right. And Korlik is taking a taking a beating here. Damn! Look at that. We just crushed that. We kept our kept our mercenary alive. We just kicked. Nightmare Ancient's ass. Boom. And that was players eight, ladies and gentlemen. I feel good about that. Uh, 41. Let's just see where that puts us. Is that, yeah, 43%. I might keep it around like 50%. I'm not going to get too, too crazy. And there's our last blessed aim. And what do we got now? 4,000 damage. 4,000. Do you remember last video where we got, we were like getting around 2,000? I was excited to be like, oh yeah, it's going to be 2,000. It's going to be crazy. No, no, 4,000. 
Look at that. 39, 49 to 4,008. Good lord. This is what's making, you know, Players 8 nightmare possible. Um, I did run into a little bit of problems when I was getting to this point. Um, there were there were some nasty mobs. Don't get me wrong. This guy is not impervious to all damage. There were some nasty mobs. I was getting in the in the area at Highlands. I had javas or um, yeah the the cat ladies, the jav the the javelin slingers or whatever. They were kicking my ass. I had the little spike fiends. They were putting the hurt on me. Oh, it was just nasty. There was a few nasty mobs ever around. And when I say a few, I mean I basically had to run through the entire act <laughs> up to this point. It was uh, it was not good. I actually welcome seeing these death lords. Because the, the problem with those javelin... With those, yeah, those javelin... Whatever they're called. Yeah, javelins. Um, the problem with those slingers is that they would run away from you. Nobody would has ever come in close. This guy works really well popping down a few of these hammers and kind of running away and hoping that the enemies, you know, follow you. But they wouldn't. They would just throw stuff at me from a mile away. Oh, God. And then you're getting cursed by things. Let's see, he's definitely not uh, impervious to damage. Especially if you get a couple of things hitting you at the same time. You got Death Lords and we've got... Yeah, like, look at this craziness. But we're doing okay. Oh, no. Our guy's dead. Again. Emilio! Emilio! And we've got no super potions. So we're definitely taking a scuffing there. I... Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we're getting... Getting our Besting booty cheeks clapped over here. Just a little bit. Again, we're on players eight. This isn't horrible. I'm not playing overly good either. Or overly well. I'm just kind of standing and hoping for the best. There's literally no reason to be fighting all of these. Um, all these enemies. I should just be trying to run by some of them. I think I was... Just getting in my, getting myself into a. I might fight them all here. Oh, we should go bug our mercenary. We should definitely bug our mercenary, because he's going to die again. Thanks. Let's go bug Mr. Mercenary, and I didn't have my. Uh, Oh my goodness, my uh, shield up. So that makes a difference. But yeah, I definitely died more than a few times. So. No. There we go. Oh, it happens. I'm not going to get terribly upset about it. That's not what I meant to do. That's what I meant to do. Kind of wish I could use charge around town. Hello. There we go. Now, hopefully, he's a little bit more survivable. And for the most part, I find it's the ranged guys that cause the problem because they will, they will just sit there and pick away. And as you try and chase them down, um, they'll run away from you. It's not usually the melee characters that really get you in trouble. Alright, let's get out of here. We don't need to be doing this. We do need to... Oh, there's a skull. Um, there is a... Uh, a waypoint in Act... Or in... Uh, on level two, I do believe. So we'll have to make sure to get that. Oh, 
Oh, that guy's gonna die. A hundred percent. Oh, and I'm gonna die a hundred percent. All right. Oh my goodness. Yeah, see, that was kind of my fault playing like an ass. Morning. This guy's costing us a lot of money, though. Emilio, he keeps dying. Becoming very unlucrative for us. And I'm not sure when the waypoint was, so that sucks. We're going to have to do some running. Come on, Emilio. Thank you. That's pretty crazy when it does that. Uh, the Ancient's Way. Might not be too, too bad. I don't remember exactly where it is. Uh, there's two over there. Yeah, it's those little quill fiends that started killing me. As they are doing right now. If we don't die first, can our health come back here? Like, look at the poison damage that those guys are doing. That's insanity. Okay. <laughs> Apparently we were worthy to go in, but not worthy to stay alive for very long. And also that those things, those lightning bolts are nasty. No, get out of there. Oof. Yeah, we definitely have to uh, stay out of potions over here. I am overburdened. Yeah, stay out of those lightning. And I knew that was going to happen. That was my own fault. I let it happen. And or caused it to happen. Should definitely still be doing it smartly. in, lay some hammers down, get out again, instead of standing in there like Emilio just did, and it also doesn't help when you're in these battles and your hammers don't hit things, that doesn't help anything either. Yeah, it seems like it's the combination of groups of monsters that really get us into trouble. But when they're like when they come up to us, we're perfectly fine with that. It's a hundred percent okay. But it's when they sit back and range us to death. Nope, Emilio, get out of there. I do wish the AI was a little bit better. Don't stand there. If you're, if you're getting fireballed to death, don't stand there. Like that. Oh, come on, Duriel Shell. Duriel Shell, come on, Duriel Shell. Yes! Cannot be frozen. Where's that? Down at the bottom. That might replace our 
This right here might replace our stealth. And then I can put on my faster cast rate again. Get rid of that magic find. That's more... Okay, go away. That's more uh, resistances that we didn't have. We do lose out on a little bit of poison resist. But this... This uh, evens out our curve. And now we cannot be frozen. That's amazing. That's such a huge thing to not be frozen. Even for my Barbarian. I might even, once I get better armor, I'm just going to swap this over to the Barbarian. He's going to need this too. Duriel Shell is such an awesome piece for that. I'm so happy we just found that. And now what's our defense? And 40%. Oh, these guys are going to be nasty. I might have to forgo these. Let's just look for the waypoint. Unless we can find some decent... If we can find some decent mobs to deal with, we'll do that. New stats. What do we got? 40%. Oh my god, look at that. Let's go get ourselves healed. Good afternoon. Too bad it isn't, cannot be poisoned. I'm going to keep... I'm going to keep one of those handy, just in case. Uh, five points remaining... 55 we're at 95 there 70 strength that's just to wear our our uh, boots so let's keep going back into that and now we're into vigor now what do we got oh look at that 41 23 And we've just drastically increased our defense. I know I could be um, anti myself. Since it still hadn't worn off. Oh, and I was just in town. I could have repaired my gear. Oh, well. Yeah, like snakes? These don't really bother me all that much. Now, what are we at? 4,700. Wow. Snakes don't really bother me all that much. They're, they're the melee guys that can come in. They do have that stupid ranged bone spear. But uh, for the most part, they're reasonable to deal with. Oh, God. This is a very spicy room. I'm just happy to be taking kind of half of the damage off of Emilio. Ruby, healing potion, healing potion. Didn't need that. Oh my god. At least I can't be frozen. I think that is uh, actually impacting us right here. That's a ton of damage we just took, but... Dragon shield. Oh, cool. Um, yeah, it's a ton of damage we took, but I think we would have been frozen and or stunned. Which wouldn't have been fun. 
Plus, Durial shell looks pretty cool. It's got a nice color to it. Are we gonna hit anything? Hmm. I don't know where that other one went. We are looking for the waypoint. Yeah, see, almost every time the enemies run in to get us, they just get stopped by my hammers in the way. But if they're not coming in to get us, it's a bit of a problem. Uh, it's okay, we're still doing all right. As long as we get Emilio tackling these things down for us. Okay, since we're here, let's go repair our stuff. The ancients have. Yes, the ancients have honored me. There we go. Now we're fully repaired. Yeah, 30,000. <laughs> Durability 150. Oh my god. And the more we level up, the more defense we get. So 88 based on character. We had plus to life based on character level. So that's really cool. That's huge for us. Eighteen sixty one. As you'll notice, I meant to mention this earlier, but as you notice, our defense while we're moving is zero. If you're moving, which is why we get hit all the time. If you're moving, you get no no defense. So there's still a five percent chance that they'll miss you, but for the most part, it's like a hundred percent. Uh, we might as well grab potions while we're here. Yeah, it's it's effectively a hundred percent to hit. Uh, is there anything in there? Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's pull that out. There we go. Stealth is gone. For now. Doesn't mean we'll... If we can find something else that gives us... Um, cannot be frozen on some type of ring or amulet or something, we will absolutely and and finding a better body armor will absolutely upgrade it but this was pretty big pretty big find right there now we've got one more level to go down here and then we will be in the throne room yeah these guys are nasty there's a lot of them there These guys aren't too bad. Doing lots of damage, but they're not too, too bad. Uh, it might look like I'm frozen, but that's Holy Freeze. That's something that you can't, um, can't get away from. I know we just got Cannot Be Frozen, and then I immediately get <laughs> Holy Froze. <laughs> but Holy Freeze is a different different thing entirely okay so I think that's the strategy when dealing with those harpies is bum rushing them oh and then we got cursed and there goes my experience shrine oh you sons of <sighs> Krex <laughs> I forgot about that as soon as you get cursed, your uh, your shrines go away, your shrine effects. Because you can only have one thing above your head at any one time, which is a bit of an oversight. 
on the developers on the developers uh, part I imagine because I mean you could have some pretty cool Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome you could be having some pretty cool uh, effects go on but maybe there's a reason they chose not to do it like that I don't know It's just getting there. You just gotta bum rush them and, and get there. As soon as you get into these harpies, you're okay. It's getting there is the problem. There you go. So all the skull, sure. What do we have for keys? Lots of the bolts. Oh, come on, Bale. Come on. Three more seconds. Immediately cursed. Yeah, see, look at that torrent. But you get in tight. You get in tight. Let's throw some hammers around. All this diamond. Yeah, you get in tight. Toss some of those hammers around. And you're okay. See? Just like that. We still have to use lots of mat or uh, lots of health potions. But that's okay. I think that's probably part and parcel of this guy. Especially how I'm playing him. I'm sure there's a a much better way to go about this. And probably not playing it on players eight for the entire game. We could for sure turn this down, and we might have to start doing that. In fact, I may go down to players five for uh, for the uh, throne room because I don't know if I'm going to be able to get through that relatively easily. And you, the the goal with this game is to still be able to clear things at a good speed without dying obviously that's never a good thing to do uh, but still be able to clear things at a decent speed and you still get most of the benefits it's not optimal but I guess technically it is optimal if that's where you're getting the best speeds because then you can do the most amount of runs and the most amount of you can actually get a better amount of uh, Yeah, you get a better amount of drops if you're able to kill things a lot quicker. But I mean, we're, we're killing stuff at a reasonable pace here. Aside from this holy freeze. Like, we're not having any time, any problems killing things. We're just taking lots of damage. Which again, that might be just part of this character. Might not be able to get away from that a whole lot. Um, let's see if I can move some of these. I like to keep the, uh... I like to keep all the like potions together, if I can. And I just realized it may not be turned up all the way on the volume for you guys. Which it's not. 
my apologies. I was just sitting there talking away, talking away. It's only a half an hour of almost, almost imperceptibly quiet gameplay. Sorry, guys. Okay, stop running away. No. Lord. Follow me here. Thanks. You're welcome. That was probably foolish to run in with amp damage on. Very foolish. Let's get out of there. Oops, saw that coming. back and get our uh, get our mercenary back because he's the one providing us all of our mana sustain it's okay it's only yes, costing warrior. us 30,000 gold every time uh, is there anything yeah we might as well clean our stash out uh, I can't put any more runes in my stash currently you Actually, that's a pretty decent one. 15 poison damage over 3 seconds. That's really good. It's usually like 6 poison damage over... over a small period of time. Yeah, look at that. We were close to a million here, and he's cost us... cost us a lot. A lot. Excuse me, gold. Slowly getting all our Superman potions back. Oh, we should go bug our mercenary. We'll get down to the throne room first. Might actually be beneficial to us to not. This is the holy freeze. I was going to say it might be beneficial for us to not get him resurrected because um, he can actually aggro some of the enemies for us. Hopefully not too many. Still would like to be able to kill some stuff here. Well, that doesn't seem good. Good thing we got a town portal, and maybe I will go uh, bug him and see. Look at that. Morning. <laughs> Seventy-five thousand gold, right there. Gone.
That was a nasty boss pack, or animal pack. Those Resurrector guys. I don't think I've ever seen them in here before. They're pretty nasty looking. The morning comes. Indeed it does. Yeah, I've never seen undead ancients down here aside from um, Bale Throne Room. Can these guys go down here? What was that? Yeah, if these guys could stop resurrecting me, they lose every two seconds. You guys see that? I that was crazy. That was insane. <laughs> Dimensional blade. I think you can carry that. I'd like to see what this actually is. Hopefully it's good for the barbarian. Come on, be good. Ginther's Rift, Dimensional Blade, very fast, 3% IAS, that's good. Tons of damage, 50 to 120 magic damage. Yeah. It's got good durability though. I feel like that could be better, or should be. Maybe I just am uneducated as to what it actually is. Go, here we go. Add it to our collection, though. screen music. I don't know if I... Well, you don't hear it here very often. Oop, get out of there. I'm glad Emilio's doing work. He's serving very much a dual purpose. bunch of stuff and simultaneously giving us back all our mana that we spend maliciously. Whoa! 
boots, crowbill. Oh, I thought the crowbill was a, uh, was a pole arm. I was mistaken. Okay, there's our safety town portal, just in case. Hammers don't want to hit him. <laughs> Just like doing this. And that's going to be our greatest weapon. Just doing that. Standing right in here. Except for hammers need to hit stuff. said cannot be frozen but like I said this is holy free hey really only one came out come on come on out and play knew it was going to happen. I was trying to get my poop in a group here. Come on, Emilio. I was trying to get my poop in a group. Really? You're not coming over here? We don't get surrounded. I can't carry. Nice. 
That's awesome. What are we at now? Level level 73. Holy holy shitters. 4300 damage. Uh, oh, are we all done? I think that was the last wave, but I'm going to do this just in case. It doesn't cost me anything. I can't carry Oh my goodness. I can't. No, you can't. Because <laughs> that's how much room we have. <laughs> Oh, this can... Oh, all res 13 is kind of nice. We don't need it, though. But it is kind of nice. In fact, I'd get rid of... Maybe these two. I'd get rid of something. And just keep that one. 16 to life. I'd actually like to get rid of both of these. What does it look like? What does it look like if I get rid of both of those and just have... That's not bad. We still have 1224 life. Instead of, what, 1270 something? Yeah. We're only losing out on... You know, 5 defense on that means nothing. Don't care about that anymore. Uh, we're losing out on 34 life, which sucks, but at the end of the day, if that's going to make our life easier, as far as uh, the world stone, I'm just going to raise the portal. light. As far as for safety. Can I help you? Yeah, I'm gonna sell those. I don't know if that's a smart idea or not, but I mean, we're not losing out on that much life, all things considered. And to free up a little bit of space in our inventory. See, this is what I wanted him to do in normal mode. But he was not playing along. Unlock. It's okay, we just about got him. <laughs> Look at that. Bail. Just like that. You shall no Nightmare longer take is this gone. mortal realm. Whoa, I never noticed his face like that before. Whoa. I've never noticed that before. Greetings. How have I never seen that before? Maybe it's... Maybe that happens away from his body, usually. Like, just over here. Hi, Tyrael. And we can... 
skip that and look at that. Wow. Champion Hammer Bro. Um, we do have to get back into it and finish up a couple of quests. We gotta rescue Anya, like I said. I think that's the only one we have to finish, actually, is rescuing Anya. Is that another Duriel shell? I'm gonna laugh so hard if it's another Duriel shell. Stay a while and listen. Oh, Venom Ward. I think I already had one of those. I think I gave it to somebody. Venom Ward. Yeah, I think I gave it to somebody. That's okay. Hey, whatever. The ancient. Okay, let's go get Anya. Uh, we need Crystalline Passage. And I know where the... Yeah, this is basically the stuff I had to run past earlier. Oh god, I forgot that we stopped the game. Nope, that's not right. down in there all the way to the right oh we're in players one that's why it's like they're not hitting us for nearly as much as If you're in players one, if you're playing online, this is how easy it would be right now. Easy. absolutely don't have to do anything else in Players 8. We probably won't be doing Players 8 in on Hell difficulty, I can tell you that right now. <laughs> that is going to require like some serious end game build. And we are not there yet. We will get there eventually, but we're still in kind of mid game, I think. Quote me on that. I could be wrong. But I mean, st since we still have an entire, entire extra act to go. It's pretty in or not extra act, an entire extra difficulty to go. I can tell you though, this is by far the fastest I've ever completed Nightmare. And on players eight to boot. I've never done that before. I've only ever done players one. I didn't even know the player's command was a thing until this last year. I need mana. Here's, Here's Arya. Arya, stop calling her Arya. Anya. Her name's Anya. Oh, and then we gotta go fight Nila Thak. That's right, we'll go fight Nila Thak. And that was without our our block on. Talk to Mala. So if good afternoon.
Anya. I wish you'd open a portal for me. Well, basically, we'll just go back again. She didn't want to open a portal for us. Oh, we'll talk to Mala. That's right. Thank you. You're welcome. And we get to increase our... Increase our resistances by another 10 points. So 45 and 60, that'll go up to 55 and 70. Boom, shalaka laka boom. And look at that. That's in just in time too because when we go to hell we're <laughs> about to lose another 60 percent on all of our stuff so we're gonna have a really hard Good time morning. you have proven yourself thank you neela you have oh uh, that would have been a good shield earlier on but it's a level 41 yes. by the time you get to that point it's no good all right, Nilathox Temple. By the light, what is this place? It's Nilathox Temple. And now we have Nilathox Temple to uh, to farm. I dare say we probably hardly got any. Impossible. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh well. Oh beetles, let's not do that. Oh beetles, yikes. Let's hope and pray we can find level two. Beetles suck. Actually, that wasn't that bad. I mean, it was pretty bad, don't even know. Players 8 beetles would be nasty. <laughs> yeah, nice. Hopefully no beetles. No beetles. Wait, why are we fighting Neelithak? Why are we doing this? We don't have to do that. Don't have to do that. Um, you do have to do all these ones. Golden bird, the gibbon. Uh, that one's optional, but I feel like you just kind of run across it anyways while you're looking for the flare jungle, or the flare dungeon in the flare jungle. Kalim's will, you have to do that. Oh, Lamb Easton's tomb. We didn't do that. Let's go find Lamb Easton's tomb. That's one thing I did not do. We don't have to fight Neelathak. Let's get out of there. We don't actually have to do that. So let's go find uh, Lamb Easton's tomb. Let's buy some more town portals while we're here. Hello. drinking the potions instead of selling them. Okay. And then that'll be kind of the last thing we do. Um, yeah, let's go to Lower Crest. And I can't remember which one it's in, so I'm going to look it up. If you don't mind me. Uh, ruined Temple in Karast. It's in the Ruined Temple. That's what I couldn't remember before. 
So we need to basically look for the big purple big purple doors in the ruined temple. Yeah, I feel like the game is starting to run really poorly. Could be because I've had it open all day. It's feeling quite choppy. And now I find myself wondering if it can even show up in Lord of Rest. I don't think so. the other one. At least we've got our speed boost now. That's pretty awesome. We might as well grab the uh, waypoint while we're here. And here's our other temple anyways. There's the ruined temple. Look at that. I know I said I would do this off screen, but since we're here anyways. Yeah, the small dungeons work really well. They look quite smooth, but when I get out into the open world, it's like it's getting bogged down by something. It seems like the jungle is the worst, the worst one. The worst act. Part of it. Grab super healing potions. And there's the tone. And I'm Essence Tone. There we go. And we go talk to Elcor, and I think he gives us. I think it's another skill point. Is what he gives us. Nice. Talk to Alcor. That'd be awesome if it was another skill point. You have found the book. Oh, it's stats. May the black book deliver us stats. from evil. 95, 70 to 85. Where are we getting 15 strength from? Ah, from our Duriel shell. Which means I could respec and get another 15 points back. <laughs> but we're not going to be using Duriel shell forever, so. We'll just keep rocking and rolling into, uh... Oh, and we get a little bit more mana. We'll just keep rocking and rolling into life. Fifteen to strength. I remembered. Oh, 10 to energy right there. That's where it was on our lore helm. And just like that, there's our there's our entirety of of uh, of nightmare done. So 
This one, I, I consider any of the ones where you get stuff like a like a tangible thing back. Um, I mean, Blood Raven is it allows you to get your first mercenary, but you don't need to do that every time. But anything that gives you something tangible back, the Gidbin notwithstanding, we didn't have to do that one. And the quests that are pertinent to the story. The Black of the Temple. Like, you have to do this one. You have to do Kellim's Will. You have to do the Guardian. You have to do this one. You don't have to do... No, sorry, you don't have to do Fallen Angel. You do have to do Hellforge and Diablo. Um, you don't have to do the rescue on Mount, Mount Ariat, but it does give you 50% off in the shops. Um, you don't have to do Prison of Ice, but again, you get a little bit of resistance out of that. You don't have to kill Neolithak. You do have to do the Ancients, and you do have to do Fail. So, um, th you know what? That's a little bit of a shorter episode, but I don't really have anything else to show you guys right now. That's, I mean, short of going into Nightmare, all we got to do now, and I'll probably spend another maybe seven levels um, running around in Nightmare and just do farming runs over and over and over and over and over again. Players 5, I'll do Eldritch and Pindleskin. In fact, we can go do that. Let's do this first. Players five, uh, no, players eight. Except it didn't take. There we go. So let's go do the Frigid Highlands. Let's go do some Eldritch real quick. Yeah, see, this act is running way better. Yeah, any of these enemies that would just want to stand and face tank with us, and we can crush them super easily. But if we're getting if we're getting enemies, like we're getting lots of like, like I said, ja um, Javelon. That sounds so wrong. I don't like it. Um, yeah, any of those, those slingers that were throwing stuff at us. We had skeleton archers down in here. It was not a, it was not a fun time. That's why I kind of just hauled ass through it. And there's that. There's that one run. We could go do the Endurance of Hate, level 2, even though Mephisto is a pain in the ass to find. See if we can do that quick, and then we can go do an Andy run. Let's see if I can figure out my way how to get through this. I think this was right. I think this was the way to go. And then, nope. Down through here. Um, down through here. Oh god. Yeah, down here, over there. That's right. I did do this run a couple of times, but... It's a, it's a long map to get over there. It's not ideal. There we go. And it's kind of treacherous, to be perfectly honest, on, on players eight, it's pretty treacherous. But the nice thing about Plus the hammers even around here, so you can just do stuff like this. I can kill a bunch of things coming through here. Try and keep our dude alive. Just drop down a bunch of hammers. Let's 
gonna say those hydras could go away. Go away, Hydra. My brothers have escaped you. Not bad, players eight right here. Look at this. So like I said, this is basically all we're gonna be all we're gonna be doing from now on. For, for a little while anyways. I can't carry any. And I am gonna have to go make uh, another character. Whoa, that's a cool looking cool looking uh Crossbow. These dudes. Ladies, whatever they. I've always thought they were dudes. Like evil warlock type guys. Vampire warlocks. Because they steal life. Oh, look at that. There's the super chest. I am overburdened. Yeah, you are. That's okay. I don't need any more of this stuff. Over there. Um. We're gonna have to start, uh, Cleaning out some of our uh, some of our gems here. And I gotta be careful not to put. I gotta be careful not to put anything in here. So I'll save that for another insight. Okay, now let's go do. Go do, uh, no, I think, is he bugged? Well, whatever, we'll go check it. We'll go check it really fast. I can't remember if he's bugged or not. I'm gonna say probably not, considering. And look at that, my, my aura wasn't even on. This guy is, that's insane. Here are way easier to kill now. So this is all part of the part of this. I don't want to say speed run. This is, this is definitely not a speed run. It's all part of the uh, leveling up experience and. Making sure you're properly equipped to go through hell difficulty. Look how fast Andy's going down. And just like that, Andariel's down. which I'm pretty sure we already have. Yeah, nothing else. 
else there. We could go do uh, the Chaos Sanctuary. We could go do... Um, we could go... Oh, hey, you know what? We could go do... Um, oh, no. Did I not grab his leg? We could go grab Wirt's leg. And I can for sure do that. Uh, I don't have enough stash space to do that right now. We are full up on all this stuff. I am absolutely going to have to make another couple of characters. Good to see you. Just to put all our uniques and stuff in there, so. Saigons, we already have, do you believe? Literally right there. Yeah, I'm going to have to make another couple of Good characters to here. You. To, uh, to equip all, or not equip, but uh, to mule all our, mule all our stuff. Uh, you know what? No, we can go do we can go do nightmare cows real quick. I'm not sure where. Probably don't want to do this on players eight. Uh, you know what? We might be okay. This is only act one. We might be all right. Need to find the uh... yeah. Look, look at that! I'm just smacking these guys, clapping big booty cheeks. Sometimes it might look like I am just like standing in a corner like an idiot, but I assure you, most of the time I'm not trying to do that. Sometimes, yeah, I'm just clicking away and it, my guy does not want to move. Right there. Alrighty. I'm trying to remember what... How, how hard of a time we had when we first came into Nightmare again. And now look at us. Flapping big booty cheeks. Don't get me wrong, you can still... still get a little scuffed up when you're getting, taking hits like that, but... For the most part... do some cows look at that yes that in there um, one of the other thing is is I don't know if I've said this before the the cow level that you're trying to make it's only good, number one, you can only do it after you've killed Bale, after you've killed Bale on each of the difficulties. And if you're in the normal difficulty, you have to use the Wurt's leg that you got from normal. You can only ever have one at a time. You can only pick one up at a time. So if you're in normal, you have to use normal Wurt's leg. If you're in Nightmare, we have to use Nightmare Wurt's leg. If you're in Hell, you have to use Hell Wurt's leg. So you kind of have to plan out what do you want to do for farming? Because you don't want to be going back and forth, back and forth, and back and forth, losing your map every single time. But just so you know, it's you're you have to have the uh, specific words leg that you're you're looking for, if that makes any sense. I do wish it told you which one it is, but but it doesn't. I mean, I know. Whoa! Wow. 
Greetings. Wow, we I was not expecting that. Not the expecting that. <laughs> we are gonna go bug this guy. I'm pretty sure we did before, but maybe it just doesn't work. Yeah, I could have sworn that we bugged him before. Try not to get smacked this time. Hello. I'm gonna have to really play it safe. Oh god. Not that way. Exceptionally nasty. And then like three or four of them hit you at the same time. <laughs> I'm glad we did this on a short, short video. I did not think it was going to be this hard. That was just a champion pack, maybe. Woo! Yeah, I think maybe that was just a, a weird... Because they were all uh, enchanted, aura enchanted with something most likely extra damage. It's kind of what it looked like to me. Oops. Oh my goodness. Definitely not... Uh, trying to get as many into big groups as we did before. Yeah, those guys are nasty. He's 
small groups like this, I'm okay with that. Seems like there's less cows in here, though. Yeah, <laughs> he says while aggroing a massive group. <laughs> Is that as far as we've gotten? <laughs> like such an idiot. I'm gonna I'm gonna watch that back. I'm gonna feel like such an idiot if I didn't have that on. I probably turn it off when I was uh, trying to run around. Oh my god, I'm gonna feel like such an idiot. <laughs> you guys are probably sitting there like turn your aura on turn your might or turn your conviction on So much better. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna grab that small charm. I can't believe it. I know, I know that's exactly what it was. That's exactly what it was. <laughs> and now all of a sudden they're just going down. It's like a blender. It's like a beef blender. I can't believe I did that. No, actually I can believe it. I can 100% I can believe that. Oh my goodness. I can't carry anymore. And there, that a car in Rondash. I'd like to check the resistances on that. I... You. 14, really? I feel like that's really bad. A circle it. I could get some interesting things. 14, that literally would give us plus two on our fire res. Get out of here. I feel like that should be like plus 24. God, this is so much better. And I was just sitting there thinking like, wow, I can't believe this is so hard. <laughs> oh my goodness. You turkey. There we go, 
now we're melting things. Melting. Much better. I was thinking like, holy crap, these cows are strong. I definitely shouldn't have gone players eight. Which again, I don't know if that matters at all. Good enough. At least now I can feel better about grabbing a huge group of these things. Slightly better, but this holy freeze helps out a ton. These guys all getting frozen. Guard. <laughs> War cry and iron skin. Yeah, see, look at that. Look at that entire thing just. We just deleted all of those, all those guys. Templar coat, three. Um, no, we still don't need that. We'll still be able to come back and get, get more stuff. More fire resist, that's good. Yeah, we can go around this way. I think I'll probably call the video pretty quick here, though. Yeah, that's exactly what I did. I used my uh, shield thing, my holy shield, but then I didn't turn my aura back on. Exactly what I did in the beginning. And another set breastplate. and hearts. We already have one of those. Mm. I'm going to get rid of a towel and or, or rowel. Keep the almond. Yeah, let's keep that. Um, and yeah, I think I'll probably call the video there. There's not much more to see here now that I got the... Uh, <laughs> now that I got my aura back on, I can't believe I did that. That was so stupid. Um, I'm going to run around and just finish off this cow level, but that's basically all it is from now until I start Nightmare, and that'll, or uh, until I start Hell, and that'll be probably next week sometime. I've got the rest of this week's videos. This is, this is all the videos done for the whole week with, I think, even a bonus video. I think this might be the bonus video or the previous farming one. I'm not sure. Probably the previous farming one will be the bonus video. Um, just because it, it was all farming, this one, there was still a little bit of story left and you know a couple little things to clean up at the end. But uh, yeah, that's that's it for this, uh, this difficulty. Like I said, we'll get back into it. We'll do hell and we'll do kind of the, just the same thing as we did in Nightmare, but we'll probably have to skip out on even more monsters because they're gonna start doing some crazy damage unless I am able to find some big upgrades here. 
like I need some better rings. I could for sure use two better rings, a better belt. I can 100% upgrade that. I can upgrade the ring, the belt, both rings. I can upgrade the boots to something far, far better. And, um, and I will absolutely keep working on that. I might even craft some boots. I'm not sure what, uh, what the scoop is with those. I might look that up pretty quick here. But um, yeah, I could even craft, craft uh, a belt and boots and just have some crafted set until I get something even better. Um, but I don't, honestly, I don't think I need it. But I'll definitely have a look. Anything that can help our faster cast rate if we're able to hit the, uh, I think it's 125. So we're at a 70. Oh, we lost a bit on our fast cast rate. We need to be at a, oh, that's right. Because we took off our stealth. That's right. Um, yeah, 75 is our break point. It goes 38, uh, I think from 38 it might go to 75, I can't remember what it is, it's like 0, 9, 18, 38, or 35 maybe, I'm not sure, I, I can't remember exactly what the numbers are, but basically we're trying to hit at least 75, and if not, 125. If we can get up to 125 fast cast rate, that would be amazing. And to be perfectly honest, we might even take off Duriel Shell. And just give it to our barbarian because he's still working on nightmare right now and we're we just cruise through it um yeah and like i said aside from that we're just gonna i'm just gonna be doing farming in my free time all throughout this week and hopefully we get get some better stuff and we can uh, make a good run of hell and get through hell and then that will be hammer bro basically done might try some ubers we'll We'll see how it goes. This will be a long-term thing. Might come back to it and just do a an update video every once in a while. Won't be anything too crazy here. But uh, yeah, with that, I will love you and leave you guys. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I really appreciate it. Helps the channel out. It it really does. I'm a small channel just starting out, so I really appreciate it. Every every one subscriber or or like or comment or whatever it just boost my channel because each one is a huge percentage of of interaction so i i really do appreciate it i want to thank you guys so much and i will catch you next time youtube peace out